dry. So I can be a bit impatient sometimes. Still wet? I hung this up like five minutes ago. <sighs> How about now? And every single time that I go to the cinema and buy some snacks, it seems impossible for me to sit through 15 minutes of trailers without eating all my food. Eat me, eat me, eat me. You're gonna finish all your food before the movie starts. Oh, I know, it's awful, but I can't stop. But see, the other day I tried to resist. Yeah, I waited for the movie before I started my ice cream. Yes, yes, yes. And I have to admit, eating the ice cream while watching the movie made the viewing experience that much better. And the thing is, I want to wait. I do, in fact, every time I finish my food and the movie starts, I get all... Mm. Great. No more popcorn for the rest of the movie. Why is my life so hard? Why don't you just watch the movie and not eat anything? <laughs> what do you, how do you, how does it, what, what? But it does make me wonder, why does this happen? It's not like in any other time in your life you think, I really need some popcorn while I watch this happen. I mean, we were together for like, Five years. He's <laughs> such a jerk. You don't deserve hey, it. Hey, hey, down in front. <laughs> Come on. Can't see the drama. Oh, excuse? Who leaves their phone on in the middle of... Oh, it's mine. My bad, my bad. And I don't know what it is because the snacks at a cinema are so expensive, but it just works. Hi, how can I help you? Um, hi, uh, would I be able to grab the large popcorn, please? Sure, that's $50. 50 bucks? That sounds reasonable. You know, and even though I can eat all the same snacks at home for cheaper when I'm watching a DVD. Uh, no. Matt, no. It just doesn't taste as good as it does at the cinema. This ice cream sucks. You begged me for that ice cream. I did not. Nat, I'm going to the shops. Do you want anything? Can I have an ice cream, please? I'm begging you for an ice cream, please, ice cream. Well, what do you want? I don't know. Why is my life so hard? Hi. Um, I'm from the cinema earlier. I heard you wanted a snack. Yes, I really do. Would you like this ice cream? Um, that looks awesome. N Nat, that's the same ice cream as the one that you're eating right now. It is, but this one is three times the price. <laughs> three times the price. <laughs> that sounds reasonable. I'll have one. What? Nat, no. Okay, I'll have two. She always asks for a little bite, then it ends up being like this massive bite. And I'm like, bitch, it's my ice cream. Anyway, let me know in the comments below, how do you guys deal with the movie situation? See, I have a few friends who are able to refrain themselves. They're very elegant. They don't touch their Maltesers till the movie starts. Or are you like me? You stuff your face and then immediately regret because you have no self-control. Yeah, let me know because this is the channel with first world, first world problems. But yes, also, this is really dorky, but I've had the best time receiving photos of you guys wearing my shirts. It's been so awesome. I get very jealous that some of you have friends and you wear matching shirts. Yeah, friendship. But no, it's been really awesome. Thank you guys so much. I have a huge grin on my face every time I see one. Uh, I also made a, a travel video when I was in Austin. If you haven't checked it out, I put it up a few weeks ago and I pretty much just ate everything that I could get my hands on while I was there. This is obviously a theme that runs through all my videos, but yeah, check it out if you haven't. Otherwise, I hope you guys are well and I'll see you in a week. Can you believe how long this past week has felt in between uploads? It's felt like over a month. Five weeks, I don't know. Time flies when I lie. It's ridiculous. But yes, no, I will see you guys in a week. Until then, I hope you're well. Don't sext. I don't know what this video is anymore. Mm, nah. Ah, bye. Okay, it's Bono Music slash comment time and Anita, I hope that's a true story because there's definitely no better way to make an enemy than to make them smell your vomit. And I hope you guys are joking as well and that you don't actually text in to say that you're sick because, well, I better put on my old person voice for this, but what's wrong with you young people today? And you know what? I have always admired people's ability to be creative when writing about their penis. Always. I would say it's very hard. You get it? Oh man, I'm on fire.